Yeah, yeah, it's your boy Urban High, aka Urban Philosopher, Amati the Kumba, and this. What's up? What's up? It's the Ink. We back. We ain't been this show with a serious topic, something that will straighten a lot of people's lives, will help a lot of people in their relationships, and we got to lay it out there. This is going to hurt some people's feelings, but a lot of people may or may not understand. But if you don't understand, just listen close. You know what I mean? But we give it to you from a male's point of view. So I'm going to let my man start. Then, you know, because I like to talk. Well, look. Basically, <clears throat> loyalty versus achievement, right? Yes. Sometimes females, you know what I mean, you know, Maybe some males too, but most of the time females put them two together. They believe, like, because see, when you're in a relationship, you know, me and my wife talk about this all the time, that um, she didn't seem to be the highest thing on their list when it comes to, you know, something going wrong with a relationship. She is like their highest thing. And I always tell them that sometimes, uh, that's that's the least of your words. You know what I mean, it's other stuff like like I said, because somebody cheated on me, they're not loyal to you. That's what he's saying. So what we're gonna do before we I break it down to how I see it, give them a story or something that that make you that made you feel that way. Okay, it's like this. I ain't gonna name no name put nobody out there and put them on blast, I'm gonna give you a scenario. If I deal with you. And we happen to break up. You start dating another nigga, boom, boom. I start dating another chick, boom, boom. And then we start, you know what I mean, dealing with each other again. So then you do some sneak shit in the text that we texting to each other. You start sending it to the chick I'm dealing with. That's unloyal. You know what I'm saying? Because... No matter what happens in me, a person or me cheating or whatever, you ain't never supposed to do that. That's not loyal. You know what I mean? Loyalty is you keep that shit and take it to the grave with you. Whatever it may be. Some small, some big. You take that shit to the grave. But when you send some personalized text between you and I to the chick I'm dealing with, when you still dealing with another nigga and living with another nigga, you know what I'm saying? That's unloyal. Because I could have been sending text to the nigga. But I don't do that. You know what I'm saying? First off, that's some bitch shit. Second off, that's not loyal. That means I'm trying to destroy your whole being. You know what I mean? So you let your personal feelings get involved in that and you send them texts. That's not loyal, shawty. Cheating and loyalty, two totally different things. Y'all people need to understand that. Two totally different things. Just because I go out here and have sex with somebody, I'm still coming home to you. Bill's still going to be paid. You still going to get the things you need. Happy home, happy home. I may slip out this only hit a couple girls. Boom, boom. That don't mean I ain't loyal. That means yeah, I just was horny. It was a dog. Then the only reason why, for real, one of the reasons why I agree with you or agree with that period is because I know for a fact that um, a lot of relationships broke up behind hearsay or or you feeling a certain way because you, you know, because maybe things going a little too perfect or or, you know, you're from this sip and the other might, you know, didn't do this, do something in particular in a couple of weeks. So you feel like, well, something went wrong. And I always say, I right, if your significant other is doing right by you, now, not nobody else by you, you know, making sure you straight and whatever y'all you know, chemistry is, what we all got going on, and that's intact, then why would you entertain anything else? What's the purpose of entertaining the rhetoric, you know, and all the other stuff when everything is going good? Why would you go and, okay, let me fit me fast, I mean, let me see, let me, let me get him followed. Let me do this. And, and for what? And everything is good with y'all. He ain't, you know, him, her, ain't trying to leave you or whatever situation is. They still doing what they're supposed to do. You hearing things or you feeling a certain way because everything going too good. And you will mess up a relationship. 
because of that. Because you forget that the loyalty that y'all have with each other is all that counts. Everything else doesn't. You know what I mean? But it's a simple fact is that if you're loyal to me, you will be loyal to me. No matter what happens, no matter what I do, no matter what I say. You know what I'm saying? You do not try to burn down my foundation. When you try to burn down my foundation, that means your loyalty is gone. That means that. But now, now, but see, on, on the other side of things, you know what I mean? It depends on who your female is because like, if your female, like, you know, a lot of females big on this cheating and, you know, shit, thing, right? But you still don't try no, to burn down the foundation. No, but what I'm saying is big, so sometimes out of their emotions, they will do something dumb like that. But like I always say, if you really care for that person and y'all, you really know what y'all kind of have, you know what I mean? One little thing should never question that. You know what I mean? Something that, you know, something that's happened, one one thing happened should never question that all. You know what I mean? Yeah. You know, if anything, it, 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 if anything is, is going to question who you are in the situation, where you stand, and, and, you know, did you really fuck this moment like this? You, is he worth getting another shot to? I mean, you know, all these things, you know what I mean? Cause I, like I said, I know, I said, I know people like it's like uh, baby dads and that and, and, and baby mamas, right? You know, they are, uh, you know, be arguing or yeah. Not, but see that still. But soon she needs some more. He there, you know what I mean? But see that she mad with him because he got other females and he don't want to just be with her. Yeah, but right? see if you baby but, daddy, you loyal, you loyal. If I'm you, my baby mama, you can be loyal to me whether we're together or not. Just because we got a child together, when you try to burn down my foundation, but that see, means what I'm saying. That's a perfect example of a baby mama and a baby, a baby mama and baby daddy. Most baby daddy, you know, what I'm saying no matter what, should always want to make sure that child good, right? Or and the mother of the child if the mother of the child is the one that, that is with. You know what I mean? So. Because sometimes, you know, no matter what goes on far as, you know, they, their disagreement on personally what's going on, if she needs something for that baby, and he, he know he know her on that level, you know, his lawyer's supposed to be to that. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> or, or she, you know what I mean? What y'all got going on should never fuck with that. You know what, I'm, you know what I mean? That's you know what I true. Mean? That's true. You know, because sometimes, you know, you be mad with somebody but still do the right thing. But I just, I just wanted to put that out there, and I just wanted to let other people understand it's the difference between loyalty and cheating. So, ladies, gentlemen, please don't get them too confused. Please don't put them two together because it'll hurt you in the long run. I promise you that. On my mama. On my mama. On my mama. Well, until next time, y'all. Sports, life, music, the good, the bad, and the ugly.